Listen to the whole thing before you get your panties in a twist, okay? I went and read the man's speech. I read it. I didn't want to listen. I wanted to make sure I read it and saw with my own eyeballs the words that came out of his mouth. It also took me two seconds of a Google search to figure out who this man was, where he was speaking, what the college was, etc. You guys are coming for a self-proclaimed Christian man giving a speech at a Christian college about leaning into Christian values. This was not at a public college. He is specifically talking about being Christian and living a Christian lifestyle. He never said, don't work. He never said women are nothing if they don't work. He did, however, stand up there, stand true to who he was, who his family is, what his family has decided together, got teary-eyed because he gives all respect to his, and appreciation to his wife who decided that her role in life was going to be wife and mother and how she has leaned into that as a Christian woman. That's what she has decided to do. And he appreciates and commends her for basically for where he is today. To be surprised that this is the way that this speech went surprises me, quite frankly, because I read this man's speech for like two seconds and he talks about the Lord and church and I knew where it was going. He talks about uh, men's absence in the home could be correlated to violence in the home. I haven't seen any, any single videos about that. He talks about the world needing more masculinity. Agreed. More masculinity, more femininity. Agreed. Did he say that you shouldn't do? Because he also said many of you women will go out into the world and live careers and things like that. But it's not the popular thing to do to take a speech for what it is and let people live their lives the way that they want to live them. Turned into something awful because you don't agree with it. Food for thought. Love you so much.